Hi guys, Melon Man here. I'm back again. John DePass, professional trainer, weight loss expert, health and wellness coach. I help people get back into the gym, tone up, get their energy back, feel better about themselves. Today I just wanted to record a really short, quick message to talk to you about my personal testimony. What's happened to me in my life for moving to the vegan lifestyle? Check it out. I've been a personal trainer for 30 years. I was a professional bodybuilder at one point in my life. In 1996, I was Mr. North America. I was in the Mr. Universe competition when I was 23, I was the Canadian representative in the competition, the youngest person in the show that year. For 25 of those years, I was telling people to eat protein. And specifically, I was a pusher of animal protein and protein powders, vitamins, and minerals. Over the last five years, I've gradually moved away from that understanding and realized the truth about raw, natural healing. I've realized that the body doesn't need all of the things that we've been told it needs. It's flat out incorrect information. Now, I don't know if anyone's trying to pull the wool over your eyes. I can't say that for sure. I don't even want to think that. All I want to say is there's no profit in raw natural healing. And that's what the problem is. There's nothing to gain for anyone for selling raw natural foods. And because of that, no businesses, no companies, no corporations get on side with raw natural healing. And the, the secret of raw natural healing remains a secret, unfortunately, unless you do the work required to dig out the truth. But there are lots of raw natural healing testimonies on the internet, and there are a lot of raw natural healing doctors that have over the past 200 years realized the truth and started to teach it and have had massive, incredible success because of it. I've been inspired by many doctors. First, of course, the most current um, allopathic vegan doctors inspired me. And then as I went further into raw food vegan, I realized that this has been around forever and ever. Natural healing has always been here, and there's been testimonies that go back into our past for hundreds and even thousands of years. If you go back to the origins of Hippocrates, let thy food be thy medicine has always been here. And I thought I would just put up for you 10 short reasons why you should consider moving towards the vegan lifestyle. It doesn't mean you need to do it overnight. You know, when I work with people and coach people, I give them seven different levels to choose from. And the first two levels include meat. So you don't have to jump into this at all. And you can spend as much time as you like at each level. So I'll tell you personally for me what happened. You know, it was three years ago now that I was out for a walk on New Year's Day with my family. It's cold up here in Canada on New Year's Day. And, you know, we were all bundled up and my family was walking ahead of me because I was starting to fall back behind. My dog was walking with me and I was walking really slowly because my knee was in so much pain. I was only in my mid-40s. I'm 47 now. 
So I just didn't think it made sense that I should be having the kind of pains that I had in my body. Pains in my knees, pains in my hips, pains in my lower back, pains in my neck, pains in my shoulders. You know, I couldn't keep up with my family that day. And it was just the time where I just said, something is wrong. Like I'm a personal trainer. I've been a competitive bodybuilder. I work out all the time. I eat what I'm supposed to eat, the paleo diet or the keto diet, which is, you know, what's trending. I've done all of the nutrition and diet research over the past 30 years. I've implemented all of that stuff into my life. I've been a personal trainer and I've worked with, you know, thousands of people. So I had lots of opportunity to test my program on myself. My wife's a personal trainer as well, too, for 20 plus years. We run this business together. So we, we have lots of time to experiment with our own life and our own family and with, you know, so many bodies and see the truth, what really works and, you know, what really doesn't. And I was following all of the, you know, modern day paleo, keto, protein, vegetable, fat, uh, you know, omega-3 oil, vitamin, mineral supplemented, protein supplemented diet plans. And I was having all sorts of ailments. Pain was the most acute one that made the final, you know, which just was the final straw that broke the camel's back in my life. You know, once I started shifting towards vegan and started reducing the animal proteins, once I started looking into the understanding of, of uh, you know, protein and uric acid and the effect of that in, in the body and the life, I realized that it was all the years of protein eating, 30 years, 35 years of bodybuilding that was creating the pain and discomfort in my life. And it wasn't just in my body pain, like physically, but I had pains in all parts of my life. You know, I was a medicated insomniac for 20 years. I took medications for five years and then just quit on medication because I recognized that it was just changing my personality and ruining my life. I had to do, do it some other way and I spent 15 years just basically sleepless. As I moved in this direction, all of those issues went away. I lost 40 pounds in the first 16 weeks of a raw food vegan lifestyle. It took me seven months to go vegan. And then it took about three for me to go raw food vegan. And then I went fruitarian and liquidarian. Now, I eat very little. My food requirements have dropped considerably. I call it unfooding. As you actually start moving towards the foods we're supposed to eat, our body begins to unfood and requires less of everything. I'll tell you, my digestive issues I had my entire life all cleared up and went away. I had athlete's foot for 32 years since I was 15 years old. I was able to get rid of it. I had a forward tilting head posture that created pain in my neck and posture issues in my lower back. I had physical pains throughout my entire body, neck, shoulders, knees, Achilles tendons. I had mood issues. Anger and frustration were me. I, was, I had a foggy head, a constant foggy head. Now I'm so much more clear thinking. I'm more motivated. I'm more inspired. Before I felt trapped and confused, my energy skyrocketed. My enthusiasm went through the roof. My flexibility and range of motion. I practice yoga. I've been practicing yoga for, for 10 years. My yoga practice has just grown uh, you know, tenfold over the last three years that I've been doing this. My endurance, my ability to run, my fingernails, my hair, my skin, my breath, and my body odor, I no longer need to wear deodorant. All of these things are just a few things that I jotted down on this on a piece of paper in just five minutes. The list goes on and on for what you can heal and change in your life. 
I do not believe you need to get sick anymore. I have not had a cold in over two years. I believe sickness and illness can be a complete part of our past if you're moving into the raw food vegan and fasting lifestyle. There's two parts to it. It's raw food and fasting. Now, you don't have to get there overnight. You don't have to do extended fasts overnight. These things will just gradually um, appeal to you as you move in this direction and you see the changes. The biggest obstacle is yourself and your mind. And that is because you think of what you're going to have to give up and what you don't want to give up. Don't think about what you want to give up or what you have to give up. I promise you, you're going to gain so much from this lifestyle that you're not giving up anything at all. Hey guys, Melon Man here again. Listen, I've been a personal trainer for 30 years. If you want to get help losing some weight, toning up, you know, we can check my website, okay? You can uh, contact me there. If you want to work with me online, I'm outfitted in my private training studio with camera so I can reach you anywhere in the world. We can work out in your home or you can come into my private training studio if you like. Whatever is better for you. I'm here to support you. If you want to meet for a short free discussion, let's have a free consultation time. Let's talk on the phone or do a face-to-face -face call online. Just reach out to me. Check my website. Talk to you soon.